Eh, we'll keep the cleric against Hunter. If he's like Seeker Keeper or Dire Mole Hunter, it's pretty good to have it in play immediately. We play like Dragon Shutterwalk Shaman. Pointing out that, I don't certainly don't mind, to be honest. Okay, I don't end up getting cards off my cleric, but it's a pretty uh, inefficient use of my opponent's resources. Just saying go. I don't think I want to particularly vision for anything. Maybe I want to vision for like another scream. I think I will vision for another scream. The scream is like very valuable in this matchup to have quite a few of. Hmm. This isn't that much damage yet though. Ooh, a Drake. Boom. Well, there's some scream options. So we'll first use the real scream. Swamp King Dread. Alright. Already drawn both my Mind Blasts, so it's gonna be hard to actually just grind him down. So do I want to heal myself and like, just hope to find Alexstrasza before we go on the offense? I think that's probably best. I mean, okay. Okay. <coughs> oh, I thought I, I thought I muted. Sorry, I, I was too slow, too slow on the mute. Do I have to just psychic scream this guy by himself? I think I might. These are my last two screams. You know, get this out of here. He's just so threatening by himself. I do have this additional screen, which my opponent does not necessarily know about because it's from Psych it's from uh, Shadow Visions. Okay, there's there's Rexar. That's not good for me. It's particularly bad for me. There it is. That's actually a great turn for me to draw Alex Straza when he doesn't have anything going on because he Rexard. Oh wow. Ah, okay, he does have the play dead. I don't have another dragon for this right now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I could play, I can draw a bunch of uh, several cards and mind blast him once and gain some life. I can try to just maximize pings. 
Like, I have lethal just pinging him twice, unless he gains life. It may be best for you not to play any minions, because then he can't life steal rush. I just need to get him to 16. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so we don't want him to be able to life steal rush us, so we're doing this. And that gives us Mind Blast, Mind Blast, Triple Ping to kill him from 16 next turn. So he can't gain life unless he has like something that specifically gains life, like Life Drinker. And he'd have to get Life Drinker right now. He can't get a Life Steal Rush guy. If I play a minion, he can Life Steal Rush me. And this also doesn't kill his Arphas, so he can't get like a, a Death Coil, which is what he's trying for. If this is Death Coil, he can stay alive. Looks like it's not. It might be like Anti-Magic Shell. Yep. Got him. So yeah, there, you know, I just specifically wanted to put him in a position where it was as difficult as possible for him to be able to uh, get out of range there. And that's why I didn't want to play any minions, even though like it could have, you know, actually allowed me to do a little bit more. And I didn't want to give him like 100% information that I had like him in lethal range, which is why I only wanted to play the him and ping him down rather than play either of the mind blasts. It would have used my mana more efficiently like that turn, but gives him, you know, gives away my plan, so.